As you guys know, this anchor team has been together for a long time. And in this business, when you work together this long, you really become a second family for each other. Today, Kevin is retiring and wow, I, it's just gonna be so weird walking in here on Monday and you not being here. And folks, I want you to see some of Kevin's earlier work. With Kevin Christopher. Mm -hmm. Topping the headlines this evening, the biggest tax cut plan in history is one step closer to reality. Here at the judo competition, and to date it's been a rough go for the Americans. In fact, they haven't won a match since Steve Cohen's silver medal winning performance on opening night. Chuck Madani, your observations. Quite simply, the Americans are getting smoked. What's going on? So he's had some good hairstyles too. Good luck, oh, Kevin. Gosh. <laughs> Keith. <laughs> Hey, I, you look, out of the four of us, uh, we've worked the shortest together, uh, seven years. I think I left LEX 18, and then you came in. So I'm so happy I had the chance to come back here and have seven years to work with you. We obviously talked a lot of sports, and thanks to all your help for, for pushing track and field onto us and helping us get video from time to time and, and just giving us some tips here and there. And always dress so dapper. I love yeah. that too. So I uh, always enjoyed talking clothes with you as well. Yeah, you know, once you get that sports gene revved up, it's hard to lose it, isn't it, Keith? You know, I mean, who's going to write those oh. snappy teases for you now on the Friday Night Sports Show? Oh, song? not me. <laughs> Forgot about that. I think, oh, I no. Think, I think Charlie's got dibs on that if, uh, if I don't miss Joel, my guess. He's, he's wearing tennis shoes right now. I mean, he's already started the retirement. He's got the tennis shoes on. <laughs> you retire on casual Friday. What can I tell there you? There we go. It's been <laughs> 20 years that Kevin, Nancy, and I have been together and it's I think easily one of the longest anchor team trios that you can ever see in Kentucky. Kevin you have been a terrific friend a wonderful colleague I have truly truly enjoyed our time together you know for 20 years it's it's, it's a Pavlovian response at about 240 you walk in here and I, you, you come into the studio into my office and, and I go hey Mr. Christopher <laughs> and, and I will miss that on Monday but Kevin my gosh, it has been a wonderful run, and I wish you and Rebecca, and when the kids come to visit, all the best to you down in Florida. It has been a unique and wonderful experience, and one that I'm so glad that we got to share for two decades. Yeah, thank you guys, thank all of you. Uh, and finally tonight, of course, this has been my last newscast on LAX 18. And before I head into retirement, I wanna share a couple of thoughts with you. First, I've been blessed with a remarkable 40-year run in broadcasting, the last 20 of which has been here at LEX 18. I'm extremely proud of what we've accomplished over the years. I'm grateful for my friends and colleagues here. And I really hope you'll continue to count on them for the stories that shape our lives. They do incredible work, and I've never worked with anybody who works harder. I believe the people of LEX 18 in every department, production, sales, engineering, the newsroom, they've all done their part on helping to raise a braver, a more beautiful city. And I'm glad my children got to grow up here in Lexington. Lastly, I want to thank you, our viewers, for inviting me into your homes each night. Now it's time for me to go home to my family. I wish you all the best. Stay safe and well. Thanks for watching. Good night.